Good morning, afternoon, evening, whatever. <laughs> In our time zones. Yeah, wherever you are. <laughs> Hello. Um, we're releasing Elijo on mobile. Yep. Today, actually, by the time you see this, it is already uh, out on Google Play. Yep. iOS, uh, yeah. Apple App Store, and yep. the Samsung Galaxy Store. And yeah, TVOS. Which is iOS. Right. You I, right. You can play it on Apple TV as yeah, well. Exactly. Is, right. Yeah. A little difference, but it's, it's same difference. store though. Same right? store. Basically. It's yeah, on yeah. the App Store. So, yeah. yep. if you have an Apple TV, there you go. You can use it. You can uh, play it on all your devices. Yep. Okay. Um, I mean, we've talked about Elijo before. Um, yeah. You know, if you've been around our streams or our social media, you've heard of this game. Uh, but nevertheless, we want to show you the well, the first real live gameplay, I guess, of. Uh, the actual mobile version. We're playing it on an iPad Air. No, uh, sorry, iPad Pro. Yep. Four. Uh, iPad Air Four. Yeah. Air Four. Sorry. Air okay. 4, iPad, iPad Air Four. Xbox controller. And we're using an Xbox controller. Okay. Yep. All right. Uh, you know, without further ado, let's jump right into it. Let's jump right in. Yep. We're gonna start a little bit later in the game. We're starting level twenty. Uh, so we see some more advanced gameplay. So we can use all toys. We can showcase a little more aspects of the game. Right. But uh, if you follow us for a while, you've seen Elijo before on consoles and we streamed it before, so exactly. um, you probably know. And you know, we've mostly shown from. the early levels so far. Obviously, you know, we don't want to spoil too much, but that still is true right now, of course. Um, yeah, there is... Um, yeah, I mean, uh, how far into the game are we? Is like halfway? Uh, two roughly? thirds. Around. Two thirds? Yeah, okay. We have like 30 levels. And right. we're currently in level 20, so... Right. <laughs> Off to a great start. <laughs> Perfect. Got these, um, these coyotes. But yeah, I think this is a good level to showcase, you know, sort of advanced gameplay, I would yep. say, without, you know, s major spoilers. Yep. Yeah. I think so too. So, here we go. Well, don't, you know, don't get spotted by the coyotes. How many hours <laughs> did you play this game for? Don't, don't do this thing. <laughs> <laughs> I've played a ton, but this, this, these coyotes... They are difficult. They're a little different, because usually you have these side cones where you can see people, right. where people will see you, right. and then have a, they have a small radius, so pretty much if you bump into them, they're going to catch you. Right. For the coyotes, though, they have a way bigger radius, so you need to yeah. be way more careful with how you navigate yeah. between them. Good ears. Yep. So... You it's really gotta of, time it right. I gotta either time it right or I have to. <laughs> okay, yeah, we try to time it right and we gotta avoid them by sneaking through the grass. So maybe we get a little hat. Oh, I already have the hat. Okay, we're replaying, so I already have the hat. Right, yeah, well, because we're using yeah. a safe game. We're using a safe game. Good. Yep. You've already beaten so this here, level, so yeah. You would get this hat right here. Um, where you can then hide in, well, you can kind of hide in the inside, mm -hmm. is what it is. Which comes in very handy um, for timing aspects where you have to let guards walk past you, like mm -hmm. patrols, so you can hide even without having to, mm -hmm. to, to hide again. So right. boxes right. or this grass right here. Basically turning your own cover. Yep. Yeah. But you can move with it, so you need to find a spot where they... What is this guy doing? Ah. Like, wait a minute, he's just having a jolly old time. <laughs> <laughs> what is he looking at? Turn away, thank you. Thanks, <laughs> Alright, now I need to move. I'm gonna move this first because I always forget moving it. <laughs> and then I stand on the other side and I'm like, hmm. I have to backtrack. <laughs> there was something. Right. So when you use the hat, um, I assume if they walk into you, <laughs> they can you, still. They will still, they will okay. still catch you. Yeah. Right, right. right. <laughs> It's not, not a hidden OP. Right, <laughs> yeah. You're unvulnerable, yeah. but it's just something. Did you have a, yeah. Like I said, you don't need boxes or anything. You can, you can hide from patrols. And it's also very nice. <laughs> it's a nice emergency button, which, which I right. use it for. Like, yeah. if you're in a spot where you're probably going to get seen, yeah. or you feel you're going to get seen, put just on the hat. <laughs> put on the hat, then you can use you can use bird mode while you're in the hat. So you can oh, okay. kind of re-evaluate your situation right. and see, right. reassess what your next steps right. are. It's pretty useful for that. Yeah. But you only, like I said, you only get it in level 20, so um, you have to, to make it to level 20. Right. And then you get kind of like... Of course, you unlock more yeah. gadgets as you can. can make it easier for you, but the level is also good. So you need to get it at some point. Our 
Let's turn down the volume a little bit. The sheriff's going ham. Yeah, they're absolutely crazy. Mm. We're gonna try this level is a little bit. Um, well, for me, it's difficult actually. It's quite intricate for sure. There's yeah. a lot of a lot of different mechanics. Yep. And there's a lot of areas in this level right. which all are somehow connected. So we're gonna mm. try to find. Oh, we're gonna try to find all the children and help them, which is yeah. A big part of the game, but just a bonus part of the game. But right. it's kind of like a collectible, sure if, I guess. Yeah, yeah. If you haven't followed any four, um, there's I don't think we talked about it. There's children in pretty much every level mm -hmm. that you can rescue, so you make your way to them, you find them in the level, and then usually there's a small little interaction yeah. where you, you give them something or they give you something. They can even help you, they give you toys. Mm -hmm. That you can then later use. Yeah. But sometimes. Sort of like a secondary goal. I yep. guess, per level, yeah. Yep. You, don't you don't have to right. uh, help the children. I guess, except for a few. Uh, there's a few that cases where you actually have to. Kind help of blocking your way, or you need the toy that they give you. Right, them. right. But usually it's. it's yeah. In most cases, it's yeah. optional. It's mm -hmm. optional, right. right. And then there's also, if, you, if that's not challenging enough for you, you will get bonus if you make it through a level unseen. Yeah. So. <laughs> If you you get uh, full points if you gather all children and and, and, and make it through or unseen. inspire all children. That's right. What, that, that's yeah. what one's called. <laughs> yep. Just get them to juggle. <laughs> you know they happily juggling away instead of working. Instead of cleaning the chimneys, yeah. I suppose that's is good. what they're doing. That's good. Right now let's get the toy back here. <laughs> ah. It's a cactus, nice. cactus flower, which are used to hide. They're like little smoke bombs. Oh, right. Almost. <laughs> uh, they're like little smoke bombs. Right. Smoke bombs. Wow. Yeah, uh, which you can hide and you can throw them. And then you have a very nice pink cloud, which you can hide and probably we're gonna show it. Uh, I suppose we're gonna have to use it later. Yeah, sure. Then so you basically, see. you know, it's sort of like an <laughs> area of effect hat. But yep. you can still move through it. Yep. Right, I see. I see. Makes sense. But it fades after like right. five seconds or mm -hmm. something. So it's very, yeah, terminal. You have to time it right. Yep. And also, let's just hide here. Also, a side effect of this smoke bomb is that if you throw it on someone who has this load above their head, mm -hmm. which usually means that they can't hear anything, they right. will be able to hear if you, right, because if you throw it on them. Yeah. Because I think it's usually they're whistling, that's why they don't hear you. Right. But if you if you throw a smoke bomb, they start coughing. They, oh, okay. So they so yeah, of they course they're kind of distracted you, yeah. from their from their little uh, tune. Yeah, makes yeah. sense. So that's why they can hear. It's it's really an interesting mechanic to, to combine those two sometimes. Oh. <laughs> oh. Hey. <laughs> Thank you. Do your thing. Carry on. <laughs> Yeah, they're noticing if you if you push the cards, but yeah. they won't investigate. They will only investigate if they see Rico himself. Okay. Except if you <laughs> if drive you keep the card right into right. them, or yeah, if you well, keep driving while okay. they're watching you, yeah. then, then they're like, wait a minute, this card this is not supposed right. to move. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> this is over. the late 1800s. <laughs> there are no self-driving autonomous cards yet. Nope. Yeah, so, makes sense. Uh, we are doing all right. We need to avoid the sheriff down there. Yeah. The guy up top. All right, we're good. We're good, G. All right. So we're here, but we need to flip the switch yep. once again. Yeah. Because we need the card to be in this space yep. over there. We wait until Mr. Miner leaves. Of course. I mean, we could use a smoke bomb for this. Right, and just smoke, yeah. smoke the, the switch. But um, I, I prefer to not use them if I, if I don't have to. Yeah, right, then have, you have them for an emergency yep. instead. Yeah, that makes sense. Or for shortcuts later. Yeah, but I guess if you were to like try to, you know, sort of speed run the game, yep. or, you know, kind of uh, get a good time, I mean, there's no real time restraints usually. No. Um, but, you know, if you challenge yourself and try to, you know, go through the level as fast as possible, I guess it could come in handy. Yeah. Speedrunners will make their time constraints. Yeah. 
They're just, they're, they're doing it all on their own. <laughs> it's actually pretty, it's actually pretty fun to speedrun. For think. sure. It, it's, yeah. it's like some levels are really, there's really nice shortcuts if you know yeah. how to outmaneuver the, yeah. maneuver the, um, the soldiers, the sheriffs and yeah. the miners. Yeah. There's a few neat tricks that you can pull. Yeah. I think I shouldn't have gone here. Yeah. I have, I have three of the soldiers and three of the smoke bombs, mm -hmm. which and means I can't have more. Maximum inventory yeah, so space. Kinda, yeah. Okay. That would have been it. Right. Very bad speed run. <laughs> <laughs> Horrible. Alrighty. So we moved the platforms here, which is nice. So we can walk over here. Well, I usually pull this down here. So I can go... In theory, I could go down here now. And that's where we end up with the child again. Right. So if I forgot the toy or something, I saw it, I can, yeah. I can now get it. You can now get back there, yeah. Okay. But we did this before, so we don't need it. Mm -hmm. We can't go up to the right because there's a box blocking us, so we need to go here. I see. I've noticed the closed window earlier, but yep, you need we to couldn't have hit it from below, so yep, makes sense. Yep, I couldn't. <coughs> I can't aim that far yet. Yeah. Okay, now let's see. I think this guy is not turning. <laughs> sure. Oh, take a risk. <laughs> He's not turning. Uh, um, I'm wondering if he hears if I shoot this. Mm. Oh, okay. Barely not. <laughs> yeah, we'll see. Very close, yeah. <laughs> Perfect. Don't turn around. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while since I played this game, actually. <laughs> well, yeah, as we said earlier, it's uh, sort of late into the game, or later into the game. Yep. Um, sort of midway through, and of course, as with most games, the levels get progressively more complex. Yeah. You know, I, I don't want to say difficult in a way, of course, yeah, but yep. mostly more complex. Yep. You need um, to combine more of the items. For yeah. example, here I use the toy soldier to distract this guy. Yeah. So he moves out of the way. Then I can go back here and help this poor fella out. Hello. Wonderful. And now we're doing paper planes. Yippee. Nice. Who doesn't like a good paper plane? <laughs> sure. And it's gonna be which I don't know. So now I can either go down here. Right. What if I do this? Ah. Can you see me back here? Oh, I can't. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Quick heart attack moment. <laughs> so now I'd rather go down here. Because then I have, do not have to pass this guy again. Right, that's where we were earlier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, I I can can, and now you can pick up the. Yeah, now I can yep, use this. The toy soldier. I, I can save my toy soldier that I would need to distract the guy mm -hmm. again up there. So I can now go down here and pick up this ladder. Nice. <laughs> nice shortcuts. Good. Pick up the save point. Because we don't know what this guy is doing. Okay, we can use a smoke bomb, I think, just to demonstrate. Yeah, sure. So you can throw it. You cannot throw it as far as you can shoot. Yeah. So there's a limited radius to it. Makes sense. But uh, I can throw it like right in his face. <laughs> and then you can't see. You can probably hear him coming, so. Yeah. So we can leave this here, we won't need it. Right, now just these two guys. Right. Nice. Nice. Well, that was quicker than I expected, actually. Yeah, it went pretty smooth. I'm yeah. surprised. I mean, we had a you know, little rough start with the coyotes, <laughs> but other than that... The coyote start was kind of... Very smooth. <laughs> I need to grab something to drink quickly. Sure. While we fly over to the next level. That's air, a little bit air of a... traveling Elijo. What nice. is it? Is it Zelda or something that has... Just flying with chickens. That was yeah, a different game. I, I think. think, yeah, that would make sense okay, in my head. I'm not sure, but I could see it happen. Yeah. All right, now we have a new toy, which is the last toy that you can get, I think, in the game. Right. Which is a fireworks, um, and we can use them to stun our opponents. So, and we can break boxes, mm -hmm. which is like nicely demonstrated here in South Devil. Yeah. So I shoot this here, box is break, poor fella is stunned. We may or might not have turned this chicken into 
Roasted chicken? Yeah, I was gonna say. <laughs> I, I think I distinctly remember that we can do one more thing with fireworks. Yeah, and he's gonna eat it too, right? Oh, okay. He's gonna That's enjoy okay. a nice, doesn't nice go, meal. It doesn't go to waste and he gets sort of compensated for you know, yep. being stunned by fireworks. Yeah. This guy we just stunned for fun. <laughs> he's not uh, chicken for uh, Oh! Yeah, he, of course, he came back from, from his lunch. Sniped yeah, from downtown. He, yeah. <laughs> he had a quick little lunch break and then, of course, I mean... Alright, I'm gonna come back eventually. Mm, and I don't want him to eat this. I don't have to hurt. Oh, hey. <laughs> Alright, another feature. <laughs> the chickens will give you a position away. <laughs> Do not run into the chickens. Don't... The chickens are evil. I used the wrong item. Uh, yeah, the chickens, if you bump into them, they're gonna do a little screamy shouty. Right. And then the they're gonna the sheriff's gonna check it out. And if yeah. you're in the wrong place, they might see right, you. Right. Oh that's actually not a bad idea. Emergency I like I like how the roasted chicken is on like a plate and everything. <laughs> yeah, <that's perfect. laughs> yeah, it's a fun little gimmick, I think. Yeah, of course. Alright. See? The yeah. hat. The hat, hat saves the hat trick. Hat trick. Emergency hat to the rescue. Yes. All right, finally, it was the longest I ever needed for this passage. I think. All right, so you could. It go, worked in the end. That's what matters. You could go here too, right on the right side. Mm -hmm. We could um, sneak past. Uh, you can. You can obviously can see where I'm pointing it. <laughs> you, you could sneak past the the sheriff on the lower hand right hand side. Right. And then we could uh, firework explode the guy on top. Mm -hmm. By shooting for the wall, and then we can go up there too. Yeah. And then over the pole. Yeah. Over here, but we can also go here. So we will use the smoke bomb again. Hide from the stomach. And then go down here. And hope we make it in time. Uh, ooh, not even close. Uh -oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I was gonna say close, but. <laughs> nah. You know, obviously you know the game better than me, so I trust you. <laughs> it might have been close. All right, now we need to shoot away through this. It's done the push over the other side. More. Get some more rockets. Works. Well, they're very, very extensive in this level. Well, of course, but I mean, this is the level that introduces them, so yeah. you use them all the time, of course. Yeah. Makes sense. Here's also the fun thing that you can do, I think it comes in handy in other levels, is I think you can do it at least. We'll just try it live on air. You can shoot down this thing, Risky. and then the cage explodes, and usually the chickens start running around, and right. um, the monks monks or sheriffs go to investigate. There's a few other levels where this can mm -hmm. come in handy, okay. where there's cages hanging up in the air, right. and you can shoot them to... So it's sort of an environmental distraction instead yep. of just, you know, the yep. regular toys. Yep. That's cool. <laughs> Alright, will we rescue our fellow? I think we should, of course. Just I am looking out there. Easy. No, I think he even gives us one for our troubles, which we can use to get back. <laughs> <laughs> that was kind of a... Mm. Well, I mean, you know, it's a good deal, I guess. It's, it's okay. good, good enough. Good enough. Because otherwise, I think you could get out if you use this coffin here. Mm -hmm. Or you can distract them with the toy soldier. Yep. But then if I have rockets, I yeah. use my rockets. <laughs> Yeah, there's obviously usually multiple ways of, as you explained earlier, yep. you know, we could have gone the other way around and uh, there's always multiple ways of how you can do things. Yeah. Please. I can hide. Ah. I forgot the these box I think we can't attack with. <laughs> they're too small. Ah, they're maybe too small, yeah. They're too little. Alright, now we run, then we run behind them, then the fire working. Easy. Okay, usually you needed to shoot the cage down there. Oh, but the firework got it. But <laughs> I shot the firework oh. away. Speedrun tactics, not intended actually. <laughs> good to know. A, a true pro gamer move. <laughs> <laughs> this is what we call a pro gamer move. <laughs> yeah. And then he, of course, brings you the ladder. You can talk to him. Yeah, sometimes, true, that's what you said earlier. Sometimes the children do help you. And you need to, yeah. So you I need to free them. I guess this one to get at least to get down there. Yep. I don't know if this is the only way. It's the only way. Okay, there you go. Then this one you have to help. Yep. Or, I mean, I guess you don't have to. 
inspire him. Yeah, you don't have to talk yeah, to him. Yeah, but you have to free him. Yeah, okay. makes yeah. sense. Yeah. There's stuff like this going also on mm -hmm. the data levels. Right. Where they give you, they will put boxes away or letters and plates. And yep. You could also go both routes, either down here or upstairs. I'm gonna go through the yeah. shooting. Well, we shoot fireworks, I guess. It's a little, little stun. Right. I'm going to open this. 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 I like how the sheriff, you know, is taking the time out. He's yeah. like, oh, oh, he's he's stunned. Okay, well, I, you know, I'll stop shooting in that case. <laughs> only it fair, would be unfair. Only fair if I stop shooting. <laughs> Perfect. They're, all, they're so nice. Not really. <laughs> if you, if you um, learn about the story while yeah. playing, they're kinda not so nice. Kinda not so nice, but. Yeah, it's a yep. I don't know how much more we want to show without spoiling anything. I mean, you know, there's been kind of, you know, there's been hints here and there already as to what's going on. Mm -hmm. um, I guess we can take a take a look into this level and then yeah. start start to find. The end point. Oh. This yeah, this is an interesting. Thing. Yeah, I just need to hit this one. To time hit this rocket so you get rid of them, which is sometimes a little bit difficult. Yeah. Yeah. I need to stun them both. Very far apart. Mm -hmm. Maybe we can combine this. Yeah, maybe. <coughs> yes, we can. Yeah. Right. That worked. Different ways. There we go. That worked. But it is possible to hit both. It is possible to hit both. Okay. Maybe. Now that I think about it, maybe that's the real way to do it. <laughs> and I'm just cheating all the time. <laughs> because they would explain why it's so difficult to both of them. Hmm. I guess we want to Well, difficult, you know. That doesn't mean we're not intentional, I guess. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. I've talked about the mass mechanic. Yeah. Because these two guys are actually back to back. They don't know each other. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Like these guys down here. They are back to back, so you cannot pass because they, they got in the water. Mm -hmm. But there is a battle between them. You have to shoot it. They go for like a yeah, minute. <laughs> <laughs> and then they will start shooting each other. And then you can go past it. So. Yeah. Right, we can ride the cards. Of course, we can. It's good, a good part of any Western, eh? True. What's what's with what of my card? Exactly. What's a what's a, a Western without a good card? Alright, then we use we can use the scene. the uh, hat one time here in a mm -hmm. way where which I explained earlier that you can wait out patrols. So we just go behind this guy. Maybe and then we sit in this corner. Perfect. Easy every time. You look just like a barrel. <laughs> and then we can inspire this child here. <laughs> and we get a rocket for our troubles. Of course, she has a ton of uh, black black powder. Is it black powder? Yeah, powder? I mean, I'm Gun not powder. sure. Yeah, could be. Yeah, I think it is. I would have. My guess would have been coal, or maybe. Coal. But who knows? Who knows what they're making here? Uh oh. Uh, oh. <laughs> go out. Close, but work. Oh. Okay, I think we can go here. Mm -hmm. I would not show the end of this level. Okay. Because uh, there's a little story cutscene there which right. reveals. We, we don't want to spoil the story, quite, obviously. Quite some. Uh oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Emergency hat. <laughs> <laughs> Just to be extra sure. Yeah. It was dark. We can see across this guy. Stand. Very nice. And then we can use, I think there's. Yeah. 
child must have actually. It just said uh, all children inspired when you inspired the one. So oh yeah, the one with this two. Yeah. yeah. So maybe that's maybe that's just one. In, or yeah, that's probably just, that's yeah, just, that's just one, yeah. this one. And the yeah. other ones, big like whatever, where you have like five. Yeah. But then of course there's, there's a few that go where you only have one. <laughs> right. Now we can see the reason why there's just lighting change in there. Yeah. Because wind. I like that there's always, you know, sort of a reason for this but... Well, of course, in this level, it's the blinds that through the wind go, yep. go uh, open or shut. And in an earlier level, there's like chandeliers that are swinging, yep. you know, and it's quite the opposite. So they're carrying the light instead of the shadow, which... Yep. But I guess the end result is somewhat mm -hmm. similar. So. And there's also a level where you walk through a sandstorm, which explains why, well, the, why the windows are actually like right. closing, shutting right. all the time. Yeah. Right. Um, it's quite nice. How much time do we have left? We have. I mean, should we jump into an earlier level, maybe? I guess we could show one of the earlier levels. Yeah. Sure. Why not? We could. Yeah. For a little bit. Yeah. We we don't want any yeah. spoilers. Just cuts your starting there. Let's. Yeah. Well, if you, you know, if you want to experience the story, oh, well, we could play the sandstorm. We just talked about yeah, it. Yeah, sure. Let's, let's do it. Let's do it. I don't, I don't, I don't think we've shown the sandstorm too much before. So no. yeah, it's it's uh, a different level from the other ones because there's no bad guys here. It's just timing. Yeah. Um, yeah, pretty much it's just timing. It's just a lethal versus the force of nature. Yeah. It's a little difficult for us now because we don't have sound. And then um, I usually go by sound because you hear the wind rather right. into the, the power. And that's where you know you, you hear the sound or cannot. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. And our sound cues, it's more of a good one. That makes sense. The sound cues you can time a bit. Oh, no. I think you can make it to the second one. <laughs> but you need to time better. Yeah. yeah, it works. But we, we, we're going to play it safe here. Right. Exactly. <laughs> They'll find a way. They'll find a way. But maybe to skip the entire. They just go the other way. Well, yeah, straight to the exit. I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. I'm interested to see if we can try to find ways. No. Oh. Risky. <laughs> <laughs> Too bad to look dangerous. <laughs> right. We can hear the hiss of the walls a little bit. Yeah. There's that little rock there. Yeah. So we can get to drag this coffin around us. We can hear it in it. In it. Too much history. It's been pretty close. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's pretty close every time. <laughs> Alrighty. Go down here. Just a hang on here. As we sheltered. We need to make it to the base. That was pretty close. That had to have been close. Down here. Stairs. I've never been in a sandstorm, but I imagine it's not fun. No, I think it's probably pretty painful. In the smaller ones. It hurts. Yeah. <laughs> there are small rocks flying at me. Yeah. Like it's, eh. yeah, especially they, like, you need... They're, because it's so small, you need very... Um, there cannot be any open, open space, right? If you just have tiny, if you have a... Um, what's it called? Like a shroud or yeah, if you have like a cat or anything, it still goes into your eyes. Yeah. Or it still goes down. If you have a yeah. goggles, it still goes yeah. here or yeah. here. And that's yeah. that's um, I've been I've been to the Sahara Desert once, and uh, no sandstorm, luckily. <laughs> yeah, because <laughs> sandstorm and Sahara, probably the, not there. <laughs> but the the sand is so fine. Yeah. It will get it anyway. Yeah. Like, especially the sandstorm. Yeah. 
Yeah, it's sense. crazy. It's crazy. I've never, ever, before or after, felt or you know seen such fine sand. Mm -hmm. It's crazy. I've never been there, but I would like to go at some point. I've just been there. It's very interesting. In uh, America, it's in, what's it called? Is it Mojave? Or? Yeah, it was, there was, some, there was not a real desert, it was more like a right. savanna thing. Okay. I think it was savanna or which? Like Joshua Tree, National Park right. style. Right, okay. So it's, it's sandy, but it's not like right. sand, yeah. sand. Mm -hmm. But we had a little storm going on there and it was, it was enough. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it was, ah, ah, please. <laughs> hey. Yeah, was, it's it's cool. interesting. I mean, sand is it can be amazing. It feels great to walk in sand and everything on the sand and beach or whatever. As long as no beach, but it water, can, it's fine. It can be it can be scary as well. It's crazy. It's really just sand, you know. But we made it through. We made it. Awesome. All right. Do you think that's I think that's okay. I think that's a that's a good spot to Little call it. Um, sneak peek. We this has been gameplay on iOS yep. on the iPad Air Four. Correct. There we go. <laughs> um, you know, just for reference, uh, yep. Elijo is available on Android, iOS, and the Samsung Galaxy Store. Yep. Also, Apple TV, as you mentioned earlier. Yeah. You can um, play with full controller support, which we yeah. just which you just did. But you can yeah. also play. With the touch, which looks like this. Right, of course, yeah. yeah. There's uh, obviously full full touch screen yep. capabilities yep. as it's mobile, but yeah, yep. if you if you have prefer to play with a controller, you can do both. You can do that. Any controller that pairs with your device yep. should work. And uh, I mean, obviously, the game is also available on PC and consoles. Uh, it's yep. been out for a while. Um, you know, many of you may or may not have played it already. So yep. basically, you know, whatever platform you prefer playing it on, anywhere, go get it. Right, it, it's a bunch of fun. Okay, and with that, we wish you a great day, rest of your day, afternoon, evening, wherever you are. <laughs> Again. Again. <laughs> thank you. For, thank you for watching. Yeah. Thank you, and we'll see you next time. Bye Take bye. Care. Bye.